Good evening. I'm Simier Davis. Thanks for joining us for WVUA 23 Sports. The Minnesota Lynx win their fourth title since 2011 with a Game 5 victory over the Los Angeles Sparks and won the closest finals in the league's 21-year history. This year, finals game led the league to the highest postseason attendance in seven years. The Lynx are no stranger to winning with a star field roster. The Detroit Lions faced the Carolina Panthers this past Sunday at Ford Field. Although the Lions came up short with a 27-24 loss, they are currently second in the NFC North. The Lions are set to play the New Orleans Saints on Sunday, October 15th at 12 p.m. With just a week until the Cleveland Cavaliers begin the season against the Boston Celtics, Cavs coach named Dwayne Wade his fifth and final starter for their opening night. Wade is a 12-time All-Star and a three-time champion. He will replace J.R. Smith as shooting guard. The New York Giants wide receiver Odell Beckham Jr. suffered a fractured left ankle during Sunday's game against the Los Angeles Chargers. He was carried off the field with less than four minutes left in the game. He had gone up for a catch and fell to the ground. One of the Chargers players called for medical help immediately after this incident. Beckham had five catches for 97 yards and a score before his injury. Sources told he is set to get a second opinion before surgery. On a lighter note, it's homecoming week at here at the University of Alabama. The theme this year is Sweet Home Capstone. Alabama will play Arkansas Saturday night here at Bryant-Denny Stadium. Kickoff is set for 6:15. The annual pep rally and bonfire will be held Friday night at 7 p.m. on the quad. And the homecoming parade will be Saturday beginning at 1 p.m. along University Boulevard. Students can vote for Homecoming Queen on my Bama website. That's the news for now. I'm Simier Davis. Thanks for watching and have a great night.